I would highly suggest doing that every morning. It definitely improves your digestion, your gut health overall. And I mean, if you're a bodybuilder, you need to optimize your digestive tract. So fucking do it. It's not hard to do. It's like five seconds of your life. And yeah, the taste sucks for a second, but once you get used to it, it ain't that bad. Um, I'll take you through full day of eating again, so we get meal one ready, and I'll see you when I have it done. All right, meal number one is made a little bit different than normal for one reason only. So I have 50 grams of carbs from rice here, two whole eggs, and usually I, I always do a protein shake with this meal, but I put 145 grams of uh, cod, geez, couldn't say that, of cod in here. Reason being is I have two cream of rice meals today, which I'll be using protein powder for, so I really didn't want to be having whey protein for like three of my meals. Um, I wanted to have like a whole food instead of just like a, you know, an isolate. So that's why I did that. Actually, it's pretty good. I use soy sauce in this, so I'm sure it's gonna taste good. And I also get a banana. So the calories, macros for meal number one, bam, right there. Like you guys, it's always there, right there, meal one. And can we get a like on this video? Because last video, I didn't miss a fucking meal for that full day of eating. And I'm doing the same thing today. So like this video. We're a week out, guys. Come on. How fucking good does that look? It's gourmet. Gourmet. So we have 60 grams cream of rice. I made the whey drip with the cinnamon flavor that Huge sent me this time, so I gotta try that out. Um, hint, hint, I already did try it out because with the whey drip, I licked the bowl. It tasted pretty good. Now we have a coffee cake muff from Dunkin' Donuts. And this is gonna hit me quick, so I'm gonna eat this now, enjoy it. And then honestly, leave in like 20 minutes to go to the gym. First bite, best bite. Money? That's money, dude. That was really fucking good. You want some too? Oh my gosh. That's sick. All right, calories, macros for this meal, right there. Estimate, because obviously the muffins, yeah. just from the website, what? That's what I mean, yes. yeah. Um, so yeah, that's meal number two. See you at the gym.
Wow, that's a lot. Dude, I'm fucking hyped. How good does that look? Dude, that looks gourmet. Not all mine. Me and Grant are having <laughs> sushi together. Let's just make sure. Let's count the rolls. So, two avocado has one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Two, four, six, eight. Oh, cool. So, it's this, this, this is all mine. Holy shit, it's a lot of food. <laughs> Yo! All right, here. All right, Grant. How are we doing this? So, do you want me to put put like two rolls in here, and then this way you get more space and you could eat in there? Yeah. Yeah. Let's All do right. that. Let's say here's your chopstick. Thank Just you. Just stay put. Oh yeah, we're staying, man. I'm my Stanley back here. Why well, we need the SUV, guys? Yeah, you need more space, man. You need more space. Just All right, it's open? Yeah. I can go there. I drop a piece of piss, bro. Don't drop shit. shit. It's kind of sticky. I got to do this for like 32 pieces. Oh, shit. No, shit. You're not good with chopsticks, I assume? No, are you? Yeah. Dude, you're practicing patience right now. This is great. <laughs> you see me breathing, bro? Yeah. I don't want to be patient. I want to <laughs> eat. I wait a whole fucking week for this. Go eat it. Get with the soy sauce now. You're going crazy. Okay, and I get those. Right mm -hmm. now. All right, bro, here we go. First bite, best bite. Okay. That's good, man. <laughs> so happy. Oh, it's fucking hot as shit. Yeah, dude. Where are the windows? The window, AC, baby. Yeah, this gotta go. I gotta enjoy my meal without anything touching me, or else I'd be disrupted from my enjoyment of every bite. <laughs> <laughs> There's only one piece, too. Holy shit. Yeah, dude, you got like five rolls total? Mm hmm. Plus 40 pieces? Oh, yeah. <laughs> 38 to go. 37. All right. I'll let Grant eat. Thank you, Grant. <laughs> yeah. Welcome back, Tom. Hey, how you doing? I actually watched, uh, you edited that video really nice. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Yeah, 13 days out, that was good. Yeah, right? Nice. Good B-roll on that. A lot of camera people are gonna kill me for doing this and leaving the sensor open like that, but oh, no, that's no. just me. No judgments, no judgments here. Plus a lot of... What? How are you losing to nature? Anthony won. <laughs> Got it. Pants aren't staying, dude. This is hell. I look bad. No, dude. <laughs> dude, you're shredded. At this point, you can't look bad. Yeah. Why don't you flip it around, let me see. You need to fix your collar. Dude, what do you mean? So some chest hair. No, no, I mean, like, it's, like, inverted. Oh, I didn't see that. Is it good enough? Yeah, now you're chilling, man. That button, this one? No, no. So that chest hair. Yeah. Bro, I feel like this looks so baggy, you no? Know? It is. Hold up. Also, you buttoned it one button off. Fuck. 
I hate when that happens. You gotta redo them all. I just worked so hard to accomplish them. <laughs> what? <laughs> it's fresh. Fuck out of here. Rock this shit. All right, let them know. Rock this shit. Rock. Let them know what? The drop, bro. Oh, bro, we're modeling next young LA drop coming out April fourth. Got. I don't know what the shirts are called, but there's some dress shirts. There's like a spring knitted shirt. We got some shorts to match, another dress shirt. That's it. And bandanas, dude. Fucking sick. Yeah, this is nice. Yeah, I like these dress shirts a lot. They fit nice. I lost some size, so it's kind of baggier on me, but it feels good. All right, let's shoot. Yo, Code Ant, April 4th. I appreciate the support. You guys killed with the last round. We had two days out, so that will make Anthony smile, you know? Some extra smiling on stage. And yeah, I appreciate you guys supporting the journey. Yeah, bro. Good shit. Good shit. Good job, team. That's dope. That's dope. Yeah, one more to it. It's... Bam! How do those photos look? Not bad, right? Oh, it's not photos. You guys see the BTS. So that's the drop. In all seriousness, pretty cool drop. Um, dress shirts, knitted shirts. The shorts to match a pair of dress shirts. Use code Ant April 4th. If you want to get something, support me. Helps me out a lot. And I appreciate you guys. So, see you back for meal number four. I still have three meals today. Meal number four. Where are we going? It is. Yo. You got a box open again. Another fucking box. Hold on, I got to take these sandy shoes off. All right, we got another box from another supplement company now. Echo Vision. Thank you for the package. We have Baj Blast. Pre workout here. I think this is an athlete formula. Let's see, we got mm, a lot of ingredients here. This is a big profile 225 mg of caffeine. I like that. Nothing too crazy. This looks good. Berry cheesecake. That's one extravagant flavor I'm looking for. I want to smell it. I, this, I can't pick anything up from the scent to go with. I don't know. 130 grams, is it clean? Total carbs, four carbs, 25 grams of protein. Okay, one gram of fat. What do you think? Take a whiff. Oh, I actually do smell like a little bit of like a cheesecake. I smell cheesecake potential. So do I. Well, listen, next meal, I can do the, I can do the whey drip and I can test this one out. So I think we're gonna do that. The whey drip? We're gonna do the whey drip. I think the blueberry flavor. The, Ooh. the blueberry, it yeah, like the scent of the blueberries. It looks like there's pieces of blueberries in it. Ooh. Well, you know what? I'm excited to try it. I'm excited to give it a shot, Echo Vision. We have Echo's EA EAAs. Big EAA guy. All right, 12 grams of EAAs. We got liver health. That's good, having a liver profile. We have knack, milk thistle, dandelion root, um, and tudka. Astrogen. What's this? Pre post intro workout, that's important. 25 grams of carbs, 110 calories, 550 milligrams of sodium. I like that. Potassium, cluster dextrin. Yeah, this is great shit. What's the flavor? Lemonade. Ooh, pleasant. That sounds nice to be sipping on. Too bad I don't get any intro carbs at the moment, but when we have to grow, that's going to be nice. Project Mass. Another low stim, kind of. Easy on the pump products too, just like a very simple looking pre-workout. Oh, who's on there? Another EAA. I think that's another like athlete, probably an athlete. Uh, okay, it's athlete collab. Athlete collab, yep. Ooh. Cool. Or 
Dude, I could try mint chocolate chip. Oh, that's a risky one. I love that flavor though, but I really want to try this flavor. Okay, I tried, tried the blueberry cheesecake, but never heard that before. Thank God they sent me two because I don't do 20, I need more than 25 grams, so I can actually try this flavor to a real serving of whey drip. Cool. I guess they have a, you know, Granny Guns, like the old, the yeah. old, yeah, 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 yeah. you're not old, the grandma influencer, fitness yeah. influencer, it's a grandma. Really? Is she with that group anymore? Or is it just like she's with Rise? I thought so. Yeah. You got some Jack Grandma as a packaging. Kind of cool. Fuck it, you're going to need to do whatever you want, right? Optimizal pre-workout. There's a lot of ingredients here I'm not familiar with. Like. Um. Tooth club moss. Oh what the? Fuck? Yeah, that's one I'm not familiar with. I guess I'd have to try this out and just give it a shot. I don't know what flavor it is. Uh, cherry limeade. That also sounds pleasant. Like yeah, the one, like a, great. like a slushy. Yeah. Ooh. And then finally we have Echo Ziz. Ziz. Sleep. Sleep formula. Ashwagandha, which is nice as a stress thing. GABA, which is nice. L-theanine, melatonin. Nice. Another solid product. Cool. Thank you, Echo Vision. I'm excited to try out these products. And I'll let you know what I think. Now let's see, what other companies can we get? <laughs> Make it Christmas Day every single day. Farm it up. Yeah, bro. I mean, it helps me um, try out your products. Yeah. So, sweet. All right, we're going to try this in like 45 minutes. Yo. So, meal number four, bad to go down. And I made the whey drip, and I licked the bowl. The protein tastes good. And so we have 105 grams cream of rice, a lot of carbs, 107 grams of frozen blueberries, and the Berry cheesecake flavor on here. 35 grams of the isolate. Let's give it a taste test. I'm really happy about the frozen blueberries in this meal because it goes with the berry cheesecake. Hang on. I'm going to give it a mix. Dude, that looks pretty fucking good. Hype. Here we go. First bite, best bite. That's pleasant. Dude, all, it just new flavors will excite me, so. Especially off the practice. Oh, yeah. That was cool to try, like, an extravagant protein flavor. It was good. I'm going to enjoy this. This is the macros, calories for meal number four right there for you guys. I'll see you at meal number five. I finished that meal in three minutes. Isn't that crazy? Did you enjoy it? Yeah, I enjoyed that a lot. That's why I'm like, I, I just saved it as much as I could, but I enjoyed it that much. EchoVision, great job on that protein. I believe this was the athlete thieving who unfortunately passed away a couple of weeks ago um, in a car accident. So rest in peace to you, man. Great protein flavor. You guys killed it with this one. That was enjoyable. Yeah, super sad about him. Um, I believe him and his friend Baxter got into a car accident at 22. So really young, but yeah, rest in peace, man. Boom, another meal, we have meal five here, we have, and let's see, 75 grams of carbs from rice, 165 grams of cod, and 70 grams of avocado. I use sriracha and hot sauce. Let's give it a little taste test, shall we? Banging, sweet. Calories, macros for this meal, right there for you guys. And um, I'll see you at a restaurant. Grant just sent me this photo and holy shit, come on, focus. There you go. The inspiration, I, was, I saw this. Nope, the fuck. There you go. Click. Dang it. I would watch Sean Ray pose and he had the bandana on his head and he'd be shredded. That was the inspiration. And you know what? To my own 21 year old self, I'm pretty fucking proud of that. Oh, that is awesome. All right, listen, I have a really, we have a story to tell you after this burger, but last meal of the day, burger, fries, story later. Okay, so the calories macros for that burger meal is right there for you guys, and now the total calorie count for the whole entire refeed day is also right there. And now I have a story time, what happened? Um, so, we book our, our charcoal reservation at 9.45 because on the website they had that available and our meal timing is around 10 p.m. So it works great. Sit down, order around 10, get our burger around 10.20, sounds great. So made a reservation 9.45, hostess calls Allie because Allie made the reservation. Hi, any way you guys can come in at 
Ali says, no, we, we, 945, like that was available. We booked it, you had it on your website, like we'll stick with 945. Oh, okay, that's it. What happened then, Ali? Then I got an email from Google Reservation saying that, that my reservation was changed to 830 and I was like, I didn't change anything. <laughs> so then I called back and I was like, hey, like I just got a notification saying that my reservation was changed to 8.30. Like it's really important that my reservation is for 9.45. That's the only time that we can make it. Okay, no problem. Like it must be a mistake. I'm not sure what happened. You're down for 9.45. Cool. I was like, cool, okay. So, <clears throat> so we go to the restaurant, 9.45. Looks pretty dead. The next day is Easter. So we're like, all right, I guess just no one, everyone's like staying in for Easter. Um, there's no hostess anymore. And a waiter comes in, is like, your reservation? We're like, yeah, Allie. And they were like, kind of confused. They sit us down and we look, the kitchen, dark. Like you can see the kitchen, this restaurant's dark. <laughs> and then the guy comes up to us and was like, hi, like you had a reservation? We're like, yeah, Allie for 9.45. And they go, we have you down here for nine. And we're like, what? Where are all these times coming from? So we're like, we can, we can show you proof that we confirmed this appointment for 9.45. We pull up Ali's phone and then they sent a text with our automated voice, auto, automated text message. Please press, please enter one to confirm your 945 reservation at Charcoal. Ali sent one. Thanks, reservation's confirmed. So whoever the hostess was that wanted to leave early, which we can pretty much almost say, Confident. say confidently because last week the same thing happened. They asked us to come in earlier at nine instead of 945 and we were pulling up 9.44, we're literally right outside trying to find a parking spot to the restaurant. We get a call, it's not even 9.45 yet, from the hostess, hey, are you here? We're like, yeah, we're, we're trying to find a parking spot, be right in. And we enter the door, the hostess already has her jacket on, ready to bolt out of there. So whoever this hostess was really uh, screwed things up there. <laughs> but luckily we were able to get our meal, I'll be honest, it was kind of shitty because like, I'll be, the, the, the cooks wanted to leave, so it kind of sucked. I mean, it was like kind of a shitty burger at that point, but... We still got it in. That was a story time. A little unfortunate, but there you go. We'll see you at peak week.